rupture gas lines. So this kind of a recipe for disaster. We put the fire out and we start rebuilding pretty much instantly. The first part of the rebuilding process was to push rubble into the bay. So if it's flat in San Francisco, it's landfill. The wharf where we are, the financial district where we're going, all landfill. If you took a bridge tour today and you went uh, through the marina district, that's all landfill as well. Then we had heaps and heaps of rubble left over and we sent it down under to Newcastle, Australia. Guess what happened there in the 1980s? An earthquake. Apparently the rubble we sent Newcastle was faulty. So, we rebuild, we rebuild in just nine years and it culminates in 1915 with the World's Fair or Pan Pacific International Exposition. And that was to celebrate not only our rebirth as a city, but the opening of the Panama Canal. Alright, now after this 1915 World's Fair, we had uh, the Roaring Twenties during Prohibition when alcohol was illegal. Then we had the Bridge Building Thirties where the Golden Gate Bay Bridge were uh, completed. We then had the doo-wop singing, leather jacket wearing, beatnik generation of the 1950s, the hippies of the 60s, the 70s got their own TV show, and then the 1980s roll around. We're almost out of this crazy decade, disaster free, and then in 1989 the unthinkable happens. Baseball is huge. All right? The Oakland A's and San Francisco Giants are facing off in the World Series, and just before Game 3 of the World Series, 6.9 magnitude earthquake happens, buckling the old eastern span of the Bay Bridge, destroying beyond repair a double-decker freeway, causing liquefaction in the Marina District and its Civic Center, and was caught live on television. Does anybody remember this seeing this happen live on TV? You hear Al Michael saying we're having an earthquake and the screen goes green. He was the first reporter on scene in the Marina District. Right? So a sportscaster covers our earthquake. And for those of you that know him, can you imagine John Madden covering this earthquake with Al Michaels? That would have been a very comical earthquake right there. For my Aussies on board picture, Rex Hunt, Bruce McAvaney doing earthquake coverage, right? One of your crazy sportscasters. Um, 